welcome back to a video. I know it's been a while since I have posted, but let's just get on with it. So this is actually a, hold on, need to turn down the phone. This is actually a, so we're gonna load this in play mode. My name's Peter, my friends call me Pete. And we're gonna call it test and we're testing it basically. Um, so as you can see, we wake up here. This is like an RPG map. <laughs> so, I have all different types of food. I have doors that are locked. And we have to go and accept our first quest. I'm still working on that. This is kind of a demo. Then, as you can see, he says stuff. You can just use that via the messing message device. But as you can see, we have that. We have different arrows. Now, we're gonna read what this says. Larva overpopulation. Whoever can do this challenge gets five bandages, five mint arrows, one beefy green machine, and a canteen. The canteen is used for that guy. Uh, that basically the blacksmith gives us armor and some tools I spy. and <coughs> now we're going oh I forgot to accept the quest we actually have to accept the quest by the way in case you don't in case you know you can't really get your arrows back unless you climb through that window which it is not intended. Um, <coughs> this might be releasing soon. Now it's accepted, and now we have the larva den. You can really do in whatever order you want to do. Though if you like playing ranged, I recommend doing the first quest. But if you don't, you can just head straight to the larva den, though the first quest will always pop up, so... Might as well do the first quest and see where that leads you. Now, as you can see, we are locked in and it has started a fight against some larva. I recommend using your normal arrows first. Just Oh, I used some feather arrows. Okay. Oh, now another war has spawned. Okay, I may have to use a fiber bandage. But as you can see I've ran out of air ammo and um this is kind of just a demo version um now that you've beaten the main one you can escape unless you know you want to defeat all of them there's no real rewards for defeating all of them it doesn't really matter um <coughs> and see you get um get your items back you can loot them, though the loot doesn't, you can't craft anything in this map, so there's no real point. And that location is now marked on your map forever. Unless I can manipulate it, then it's stuck there forever. Yeah, forever. Um... So yeah, but uh, man, I need to dis I need to hide that. Okay, but as you can see, this opens and it give and they give it and he gives you the stuff. I'm still gonna put in dialogue there, and this is open and this is the blacksmith. Uh, still need to repair that. Um. 
a fresh new weapon. Um, anyways, I'm going back and I'm continuing and that's the design, that's the playground, okay. <sighs> okay, so, as you can see, <laughs> we still need to prepare this, or repair this. Now, I'm gonna end the video here, and I'll give you guys some updates every time, okay? So, see you later, and, well, don't know really what to say at the end, but just see you later.